Hello everybody, welcome back to the GG Gamer. Today we are playing Stray. I've been waiting for this game for a long, long time. It's a game involving cats. How can you not enjoy that? Uh, I'm already about an hour or so in. I'll try to avoid, you know, any spoilers or anything like that. Uh, but let's jump right into it. So, um, yeah, like I said, I'm about an hour into the story. Um, so, you know, hopefully I won't... Uh, give any spoilers away or anything like that um, so you know long story short you're straight as the uh, title says in a post-apocalyptic dystopian I mean it's all from the point of view of a cat so you don't really know what's kind of happened to humans but you know oh, it's adorable they've actually modeled that you can meow so if I press alt I think it is oh, that is just adorable okay so uh, you're in a dystopian kind of world, you know, I haven't actually seen any humans yet, it's all kind of these robot things. Oh. Come here. Um, don't know if that's crying or good or whatever. Um, so essentially you start off with your kind of pack, again, no spoilers, um, and you sort of trip and fall, you know, there's a loose pipe, and you end up in this kind of world. When you're like, you're slowly piecing together sort of you know what happened so this is obviously quite a long time ago oh paper bag yep this when you actually put this on the controls don't work so yeah i'm trying to move around but yeah no he, he can't yeah yeah anyone who's seen a cat with a there we go with a bag on their head or any kind of box or anything oh it freaks them out What's to say? So, the other thing to mention is you found this robot. Um, so, you go into a lab, and it's, so far as I can tell, it's the consciousness of a scientist uploaded into this robot. Uh, you both want to get to the outside, uh, outside the city, um, and to get there, you're helping each other out. So, access to the sewer is condemned because of the proliferation of Zerks. Stay safe, stay in the uh, safe zone. So, the Zerks are the enemy in this game. So far, you know, they haven't been too much of a threat. They've been like blobs and, you know, that, that kind of stuff. And you just kind of run and out, outrun them, outmaneuver them. But I've got a feeling there might be some more difficult ones later on. So, uh, our next mission is to go into the sewer. So, we need to ask this robot how to get there. Okay. There must be some sign of it around here. Let's search the whole flat. Okay. Which flat am I going to? So, to get to a flat, I assume I need to get to the roof. So, let's get to the roof somehow. There we go. So, it's quite ingenious the way they've done this kind of parkour. You know, but, you know, they're kind of climbing and physics on it. It's quite cool, actually. What's this? Okay, so when you say it says remember, your little robot scientist buddy... Like pieces in the the past back together, he remembers something. Let's do it. Okay. I've got that many memories, but I've got a few. Let's see where we need to go. Where's the flat we need to go to? I mean, come on. I think let's start with this one. Right, so. You do make some friends along the way. Uh... I think I've already been here. Yeah. Uh, when you fell down uh, from, like, you know, your pack, uh, it broke its leg and it was, oh, it's heartbreaking. You know? Just um, seeing an animal in pain is just terrible. Ah. Developers have also put, like, these little kind of things you'd do as a cat. So you can come across, like, somewhere to sleep, like this. And he literally just curls up. And then you go past things like chair legs or carpets and you can actually scratch them there we go enough sleep for now do the yoga pose yoga pose compulsory yes there we go all set to go now so i have to find a flat uh, to search for a weapon that was apparently being made um, by the scientists that can fight the zerks um, the zerks are the main enemy it would be quite handy. I've got a feeling it's going to be some sort of UV weapon. Because you know, earlier on they did sort of intimate that, you know, they're repelled by UV light. Uh, the real constellation of the big circle before 
Those grains are okay. There we go. Drop. And you can jump in. Meow. Right. Okie dokie. So I've already been here and found something, but I'm going back through all the kind of flats uh, to find this weapon, like I said. And you can have a little drink as well. Not sure if that's the cleanest of water, but, you know. Uh, thirsty work, you know, saving the world. Right, I'm not sure this is the one or the flat I need to be. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's jump down. Right, oh, there we go, final one. Let's jump up and have a look. Ah! Huh? What does this do? Oh -ho. Yep. I just love pushing buttons. Doesn't matter what it is, they just like pushing things. Uh, right. Any sort of weapon looking thing around here. You have to do it, you have to do it. Like the boots on himself. There we go. Right, keep looking. Oh, I did open a safe earlier. I wonder if it's something in that. Where did that safe go? So yeah, I did come in and open a safe and there was something else in there. Aha! Uh, nope. Anything there? No. Let's see. Me, uh, let's, uh, let's search the whole flat. So, I mean, I'm kind of intimating from that. This is the right flat, but it just doesn't look like it. Uh, and you can meow. Oh, it's very cute. Right, the other flat is here. I think I've already been in that one. The first flat is there. Right, check this one, and then if no joy, we'll go to the other flat. See if anything's in there. You can get so turned around in this game when you haven't got like. A GPS or a waypoint or something to go off like um, in a lot of games it can get really you know it can really turn you around okay so this is the only other flat I know of but it's up here you dokey and through the window can I hit this oh one more time Funky V. So yeah, this is the other one. You can claw the carpet. Oh, I love doing that. All right, enough of that. Destroying the carpet. See if there's any weapon around here. It's here. Cylindrical city. Yeah. So they told me earlier that you um, you're not actually seeing the stars at night if you look up. Those aren't stars, that's like the roof of this city. Whether that's true or not, you know, is another matter. Ooh. Watch out! Yeah, yeah, I meant to do that. I meant to do that. Yeah. See, I mean, I don't think knowing cats, they'd ever just jump into a bucket like that. Not unless they're like, you know, they've been trained to do it. Okie dokie, over here, anything to see? What's this? Sheet music? There we go. Okay, what's in here? Oh -ho. Uh, what's that sound at the door? Probably nothing. No, it's me. Oh, who's this? Uh, you look, you do look weird and small, but there's something about you. Uh, I don't know what to show you. I don't think any of that. Pep tour. Uh, very agile there, very agile, very agile. Oh. 
door of a way to get down. Let's see what's in here. Nope, didn't want to do that. I can't get in there, can I? Right, there's something in there. Not quite sure how to get in. That's all locked up. Okay. So maybe there's something up there I can get. Oh, digging us all one. Yeah, now. Nope. Right. Okay, okay, I'll read that later. Ooh, is this the way I can get in? No. I'm sure that window's open. Do I need to get it on the way down? Maybe that's it. Maybe I need to get it on the way down. Right, okay, be ready this time. So there is something in there, but yeah, clearly uh, doesn't want to unlock yet. Any anything in there? Let's uh, run a bit. Haven't been in here. Do some Tai Chi. They all look a bit sleepy. Oh, yeah, watch out, I'm here. Okay, can I wait somewhere a bit more? Yeah, be careful, mate. The soft ones left us the city. Our home is their legacy. Oh, so I assume that means humans. Right, let's see. Claw the mat, claw the mat. Don't poke me with your stick. Right. I think that's enough for them, don't you? Well, I'm going to leave that video there. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed uh, playing Stray with me. I'm absolutely loving this game. You know, even though, you know, it's kind of puzzle logic sometimes, you can get a bit frustrated. It's a really lovely game, and uh, you can tell a lot's gone into it. But, uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.